Qdrent versus PG Vector. Which is the best vector database solution in 2025? Qdrent and PG Vector are both solid options for vector databases. Qdrent is a purpose built vector database designed for high performance similarity search with features like filtering, clustering, and easy scalability. It's a great choice for machine learning and AI driven applications, offering both a cloud version and an open source option. Qdrent has flexible pricing based on usage with a free tier for basic use and paid plans starting at around $20 per month for higher scale developments. PG Vectors, on the other hand, is an extension for PostgreSQL that adds supports for vector data, making it a good choice if you're already using PostgreSQL and want to keep everything in one database. While PG Vector is a cost effective, it may not offer the same specialized performance and features as Qdrent for larger or more complex vector search tasks. Both are great, but if you are looking for something purpose-built for a data vector, Qdrent might be the better choice. And that's it. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you on the next one.